Hey traders, this is T Bradley 90 from the My Investing Club chat. I'm one of the top mentors and moderators in chat. And we have a very special video for you guys today. Joe Kelly, who does his Trading Basics series every single Sunday, releases a new video. Today, we have a very special video of episode 36, where he talks about APOP, ticker symbol, as a live trade, which is the first resistance and death line. And while today is just a preview of the full-length video, if you want to watch the full-length or any of our exclusive content, then become a member of MIC. What's going on, everybody? It is Saturday, August, gosh, I've lost track of time, 17th, 2019. I'm in Philadelphia right now at the MIC one-year anniversary meetup. I'm doing this video on a recap on a trade on APOP that I promised everyone. Um, there are two trades, well, three trades in this setup that I want to go over here. So the first is a first resistance short on APOP. Now, I'm going to show you this trade, and this trade ends up not working out. But I want to show you why it didn't work out. So you can see on my bottom right of my charts, I've got down here the 70 and the 80 lines. So you can see the 70 line is pretty key. You can see all this resistance over here. But over here, it just blows right. It just blew right through it. I actually missed this. And the reason why I didn't take the 70 line is because it just came from the 60 line. So this is when we talk about using outer lines, okay? So you can see I get filled right here. The stop that I did not do correctly, I thought I would use a stop barely above the line, which is a breaking rule. It's breaking one of my rules. So you can see I stop out right there, nearly dead top, and take a small little tiny loss. I, I literally take like a, like a five cent loss there. But what I was looking for is for it to pull back to around this 70 line support. So I was hoping that I could squeeze um, <clears throat> five, 10 cents out of this pullback and out of the first resistance and find my way into a profitable trade here. And I use slippage above the line. So, so my stop shouldn't have been 81. I know it shouldn't have been 81 because I have a rule against that. Uh, I don't use it a penny above the line, never do. Um, I always give it some wiggle room, but in this particular case, I failed to do that. So you can see now that I've identified another line at 90 and another line at one. So at the 90 line, when it started hitting, I wanted to see what was going on. And you can see that trade happened up here. Oh, so I went away with it, but you can look at it on the top right up here. So the 90 line is right here. I shorted into that, covered 80, 70. And now it's a death line setup. You can see a clear death line right here at the 70 line. You see the breakdown below here, the breakdown below here, it's a death line. I shorted into that line right there. I got several more orders out here. I'm trying to get filled into strength, but it, it, uh, it just keeps falling slightly short of my entries. And you know, it's frustrating when this happens that you, you wanna like enter, but you have to be patient. You have to wait for the orders, don't chase it. Right here as I get the pullback, there it is. I've got my orders waiting, ready to go. This is the power of the death line into the close. When you get that breakdown into the close, this is generally what happens right here. So, Hey traders, this is Tosh. I go by tbradley90 in the My Investing Club chat. Just wanted to reach out and say if you have any questions about MIC, joining MIC, maybe you're a member already, you have three ways to contact myself personally and through MIC. You can hit our social media. You can hit me through PMs in chat, or you can contact us through my email at tosh at myinvestingclub.com. That's T-O-S-H at myinvestingclub.com. I will get back to you in a timely manner, and I'm saying this because I'm here to help, and I don't want anybody to be afraid to reach out and ask any question that they have. We are here for you guys. All right, see you guys.